So a little more intuition about why the marginal rate of substitution is equal to the price ratio. So the price ratio tells you basically if you give up one unit of, say, shelter, how much extra food can you get? And you can see that because the, uh, the right ratio is equal to PS over PF, okay? So if we give up one unit of shelter, how much money do we get back? Well, we get back the price that we had, PS. So that's your extra money in your pocket. How much food can you buy with that? Well, divided by the price of food, and that tells you how much food you can get, okay? Meanwhile, the marginal rate of substitution tells us if you give up uh, one unit of shelter, how much uh, food do you require to have the same utility, okay? And if these things are not equal to each other, then there's a, a way that you can do better, right? So suppose this one was equal to negative three and this one was equal to negative one, okay? That would tell us that if you give up one unit of shelter, you need to be given three units of food to be equally well off, okay? Alternatively, you could give up uh, like three units of food and get one shelter and be equally well off. The price ratio though says you give up one unit of food, you can get one unit of shelter for the same price, okay? So if these things are not equal, what this is saying is uh, if you 